So, give up a model like this and want the face to be flat, here's what you can do. Go into side view auto graphic mode, turn on S gray, press B to bar select the vertex and double press G to slide it down to the end. Then press Alt C right at the edge to select it and press C to use circle select mode and press the middle mouse button to deselect the unrelated vert and slide them back in. Repeat it for the other edge and slide the edge back in and now the face should be flat. For the second method, select all the related edge and dissolve them. Then go into side view auto graphic mode and s gray. Press K to use the knife tool, then C to enable cut through and A for angle constraint. Then just cut a line for the vertices, and now the face should be flat while maintaining the quad topology. And now for the last method. The monkey way, correct the vert, put vert in place, make face flat, work like. Second situation. So you need to select this face on a mesh like this. Real simple, select one face, press shift G and perimeter. Done. Now you can do the same for the other face as long as they are not way too deformed from each other. Doing this might result in Blender selecting the unwanted face. In that case, just switch to using Alt C like the first tip and you should select all the face you need. But honestly, the fastest way to do this is always in orthographic mode, S gray, and a bar select. Please use this method instead of monkeying around like this. Okay, the third one. Need to quickly select vertices from that side to this side through the bottom here. Well, easy. Just select one edge and hold control while selecting your desired edge pad. Just keep going until you reach the end. But keep in mind that doing this means Blender will pick the shortest pad. So if you want the edge to go around it, then you have to guide it closer to the source. But here's an extra problem. You spend time selecting a lot of edge, but at the end you forgot to edit the edge flow that is missing edge here. So what are you going to do? Flare around go mad! No! Be a better blender user, select the vertex group and assign already selected edge to it. Then fix whatever you need to fix and select the vertex group again. Done! Alright that's about, see ya.